Hey everyone, this is Staffa from AdaContinues.com and we are looking at Infectionator Survivors. This is uh, developed by Togue Productions, published by Togue Productions. It was sent to me by Black Shell Media, who's probably helping them with marketing. Uh, so, uh, also, this is an a early access game. Let's uh, have a look at this. So basically, all right, let's let's delete my game. Yeah, let's start a new one. So basically, this is uh, like a roguelike or a roguelite um, with some like XCOM and some like tower defense elements. Um, has like as far as the visual style, has like a mix of these like high definition art. As well as like uh, the gameplay is a uh, 16-bit looking, you know, like Super Nintendo looking game. Um, so in the beginning, it gives me like these uh, different choices. Uh, like these are, I suppose, the generic dudes you can start off with. Uh, these guys, the good and the bad, no man left behind. Left for Dead, and uh, I'm not too sure who these people are supposed to be. I think that, lo that looks like Freddy Wong to me. I'm not too sure who that is. Matt Murdock? I don't know. But uh, either way, let's uh, let's choose Left for Dead because why not? So let's get going. Get into the game. Car runs out of gas. Dudes are gonna come in, just plow through. Let's skip this, get into the game. Alright. So, right now, I can move these guys around. They're. These dudes are really easy, like, they're just crawling. So, can I pick up these chips? Let's, let's search that. Let's go over here and start shooting. I hate Bill. Searching. Alright, go ahead and start searching for that. You search that. You search that. You just stand over here. Alcohol. Alright, let's let's get started. Alright. So all you guys move over here. Okay. So yeah, like like basically this portion of the game is uh, basically like um, a tower defense. I want to get all these guys over here so they can be like protected behind this area, and uh, you know that way they're shooting over the counters and they have to like go around. I have a plan. Like they'll just say random things. Alright, let's start this. I'll get a little bonus for starting early. Where's Zoe? She's behind you, dude. So I'm gonna move him over here and him over there because uh, he has the shotgun. Alright. So I'm done with that area. So like so far, I've seen like two different types of play modes. There's like this tower defense style game, and then there's like a XCOM exploration type game. And I I don't know if there's any more type of modes. So, anyways, let's you go over here, search that. Don't have much time. Uh, anything else to search? Search that. Um, you stand here. You stand there. You go over here. You go there. No, no, no. Over here. Over here. Alright. Build that. Go back here. No, no. There. Alright. You're not doing much. I'm gonna have you go over here. Search that. Oh, that can be searched too. You search that. 
Yeah, basically I'm having these guys search just so they can, uh, you know, get money and what whatever. Go here, no, no, down there, there. Salvage. Everybody reload. Salvage. Don't need this turret. Bam! Look at all that. Oh, that is a fat zombie. Whoa! That was a close one. I have a plan. I hate this place. done so yeah that's like the first section and then I get a base so this is the base like basically like there's the car this dude's telling me all about it there's a workshop to make tools and upgrades and repairs uh, the garden is so that I can uh, plant food or capture animals that are trying to eat the food uh, there's a kitchen. I haven't really done any of this stuff yet, so. And then there's missions, so let's let's go ahead and start the next mission. Mission, continue. So since I only have four people, I will assign all the four people I got. And this also reminds me of XCOM, you know, like the whole base building stuff. Uh, and I'm assuming that if a person dies, they're gonna be dead for good. So, okay, there's a quest. Can I go to the quest? Or do I only got the option to explore? Alright, let's do explore. Alright, so explore, like, you got like this fog of war. And, can I, oh, I can do this. I did not realize I could do that. Oh, don't want to step on the green. The green is poisonous. Or acid. Oh. There's a lot of acid. Oh, it's just spewing everywhere. So it says uh, 8 out of uh, 23 Zeds. So. Let's uh, search this. You search that, you search that, you come here, everybody get in position, anything down here, nope, alright, let's move in, oh you didn't get that, alright, come back here search that. Where's Zoe? She's right in front of you, dude. Alright, I hate zombies. Let's go over here. Search. You search that. You guys check the perimeter. Somebody search that. Oh, no, 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 no. You keep searching. Go get back to work. Oh, found a duct tape. Everybody reload. And any zombies? Search that. You search that. Whoops, I ended that too early. I wish what? I'm too old for this. I'm sorry. Oh, what's going on down here? Check. While scavenging, you found a corpse. Next to the corpse is a backpack. Uh, search the backpack. So I search the backpack. Inside the backpack, you found a hammer. Nice. Uh, 
Oh, there's a zombie. How about you search? Everybody reload. So one thing about this game is I know, it, like, unless I'm doing something wrong, let's see, I'm using the keyboard, I can't move past, um, the screen. Like, you know, if I go up here, over here, over here, anywhere, like, I can't scroll the screen. So unless I'm doing something wrong or weird or something, like, the only thing I can do is, uh, like, I can use the keyboard to switch between these guys, like that. Boom, boom, boom. I can also press this, and I can also press these to go to people, but, like, there's no way to, like, just look around. Alright, anything up here in this corner? No. Alright, that's enough over there. 18 out of 23 Zeds. Oh, we didn't get that. Alright. Search. I hate Bill. That's kind of weird that I can see the sparkle through the wall. Alright. Search that. You two go up here. All you guys come up here. Nothing up here. So I'm pretty sure the, the maps are all procedurally- Whoa, get out of there. That's dangerous. That's acid. The maps, I'm pretty sure they're procedurally generated. You know, with the whole uh, roguelite element. Some sparkly down here. So it seems that like ammo is also the um, money in this game. Let's leave. Go ahead and leave. Let's uh, do a mission now. Good job. Once an area is explored, objective areas will unlock. You can move and press go. All right, let's uh, click this place. Go. Um, uh, camp, scout, sure, let's scout, alright, um, I don't have that, whoop, you, search that, You guys just chill over here. Actually, you go over there. Go ahead and search. 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 Come over here. You come over here. Go there. You search that. And let's get going. Let me stand a little closer. Stay positive, guys. Alright. You search that. 
you guys get over here you get over there search that and it's like go This car, you go over here, search that. Search that. You guys stand there. Not done searching that. Stand here. Go ahead and bring it. All right. And anything else? Let's do it. Oh, also I got this uh, bomb thing, which I only have like three of, and like I can basically, like, boom, just bomb something. Let's cancel. All right. So, anyways, this is uh, uh, this game, um, Infectionator, sir. Uh, yeah, Infectionator Survivors. Uh, it is. Let me see real quick. It is twelve. Sorry, it is eleven ninety nine. Uh, early access. The developer says that says that they're pretty close to uh, completing the game. It's pretty much feature complete. They're just uh, working on uh, uh, finishing up the content, and uh, I think it's pretty cool. I like it. Like it looks good. It plays well. Um, yeah, this is a pretty cool game. Uh, I mean, definitely whenever this game comes out, I'd say check it out. It's pretty cool. So if you're into games like XCOM and you know but with more uh, real-time rather than um, turn base I say yeah check this out uh, anyways if you got this far in the video I'll leave a comment let me know what you think have you played this game have, have you not played this game and uh, if you haven't played this game uh, uh, is this something that uh, you want to check out eventually let me know in the comments anyways this has been Stafa thanks for watching and I'll see you guys soon with more gameplay videos and the podcast